My name is Rhapsody, and welcome back to the Binding Isaac Rebirth X2 featuring... Over the Potato, hello. How are you doing today, Rhapsody? Pretty damn busy. <laughs> I figure I said pretty, pretty damn, damn... busy? I think I said pretty damn well before, so... Let's go with busy this time. <laughs> Change it up a little. Um, so I think today we decided on an Eden run, is that correct? Mm-hmm. Work through the characters in order. Okay. Might as well. Uh, so I'll just jump into a game and then I will uh, give you a little update on the seed. Okay, so I'm not entirely sure actually. Will will you spawn as the, with the same items as me? I will. As Eden? Yep. Okay. Same items and then, same stats. Uh, then the seed... Uh, the stats are pretty poor to be honest. Uh, but we do have nine lives, which is nice. Yeah. Okay, so seed is ASS. ASS? Ass, actually. <laughs> yeah, actually, an uh, like ass. Excellent. Uh, zero, B, zero. four, E, yep. W. That should be it. It kind of looks like. Like, there's another word in there, like, by, if you look at the four for a Y. So it's like, also by W. I don't know how that works as... <laughs> oh, forget me now. Fuck yeah. I don't, I don't know how it works. That's not horrible stats. Is, what is this? Damage is decent. Forget me now. Yeah, you forget ever me forget now. me now? You don't? What's your I've use item? A, an hourglass. Oh, an hourglass? Maybe it's given you a, du a different use item because you don't have the Forget Me Now unlocked. Possibly. Ooh. Ooh. I've got that nine lives, though. That may be the though. case. I have nine lives, and there was a curse yeah. room directly below me and a item room to the right. What was in the item room? Uh, $3 bill. Random tears. Yeah, okay. So that's what, that's what I've got as well. Oh, come on. Uh, I figured if you made the spawn... And how do we uh, have three spirit hearts? Is that just... Uh, three spirit hearts, we just spawned with yeah. that as our health. That's just our health stat. I imagine we actually spawned with only three spirit okay. hearts. And then since the game gave us nine lives, that also gave us a red Nine heart. lives, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's quite lucky, uh, I must say, because I would expect to die at least nine times in any Isaac run. It's pretty damn lucky. Um, but I'm going for a win today. You get you for a think, win today. thinking of going for a win. You've won I, I the am. Last I'm two. gonna I'm gonna try extra special hard. I don't I don't think I've won. I think I've won two out of four. I don't think I've won the last two. I seem to every time we do this, right? Mm -hmm. There seems to be you know we do two matches, we do two games, and the second one always seems to go a lot better than the first one. I think I just need like warm up time. I think the game if, needs if to warm that. up to you, actually. That's what's going on. The troll engine is just there for the first few minutes. That's what it is. Yeah. It's there to kind of purge out casual players. That's exactly right. <laughs> I like that. That's great. Have you seen any uh, tinted rocks on the first floor? No, but I've seen... I have not seen a single one. I've seen a boss called Widow. That probably doesn't count. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what exactly... Uh... No, what was I going to say? I can't even remember what I was going to say. I was, I was going to ask a really, uh, really interesting question there, but... Oh, yeah, um... I've got, like, the hourglass or whatever that means. Mm -hmm. What does that... What does that do in terms of effects? I presume it's a slow effect. I just used it on the room previous, and... Does it slow for a specific length of time or, or it's, whatever? Yeah, it slows for a specific length of time rather than doing it for the whole duration of that room. Which is a little uh -huh. sad. Okay. That is a little sad, but to be honest, that's fair game, I suppose. Okay. I, uh... uh that boss fight might be very kind to you. <clears throat> I, well, I just lost three, well, two and a half spirit hearts on it, so I don't think kind is really the word that, uh... No, it's word pretty... that I would use to describe it. Oh! Yeah. I see what you mean. <laughs> that's not too shabby. That's not too shabby at all. Um, I've got a temperance card. What does that do? Is that the blood bank? That's the blood bank, yes. Um, the... Okay. I think in space of where you got your temperance card, I got a chaos card. A chaos card? Was yes. that in the, the big 4x4 four four room? Yes, it was. Yeah. Sweet. Uh, 
Oh, holy water? I've heard that's atrociously bad. Yes. Or maybe that's just me. Is it worth taking? Not a... Uh, in the first game, it was actively not good. But in this game, it's just like, you know, mm -hmm. null. Like, it doesn't ever really matter. It's not good nor bad. Okay, so I, I went to the dice room, and I re-rolled my, my entire run. Oh, dear. And I should have done it. And so now I've got Little Chub, which is quite nice, and I've got the Parasite, which is, I wouldn't say actively trash, but passively trash, perhaps? The Parasite? You calling that trash? Yep. Them's fighting words, buddy. I'm saying, I'm saying that it's not as useful as another item that I could have been given. Wow. That's what I'm saying. You that's, feel? That is a bold statement. But maybe there. that's just me. I think that might actually see, I, only see, ever I don't be. really... <laughs> See, I can't really. I don't have really have anything to gauge items by because I'm not. I'm not a, a pro player like you are. You know what I mean? I'm not a pro player like me. <laughs> <laughs> I should know. I had a few no runs of Isaac today. Oh, how did they go? Um, oh, the haunt. Fuck off. Yeah, that's. That's what's kind of, like, stopped my speech. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Fuck you, Haunt. Oh, no. Oh, I just took a heart damage. Oh, come on. Come on, buddy. Don't do this. Oh, I just... <sighs> Such a bad boss. Yeah. I've I only I, burst it, like, once as well. I do straight up think it is actually a poorly designed boss. <clears throat> do you? Yeah, because there's, so. uh... The so what what's the um what's you, you you know the attack with the split of five red tears? Uh I'm probably about to face it, but yeah. It yep, has it. it has almost no telegraph for it. So if you're actually shooting at the haunt constantly, you can without higher than base speed, rarely dodge it. So it becomes really annoying. Uh-huh. Oh, that does not that does not sound good. Have you been to the curse room? If so, would you recommend it? Uh, I have been to the curse room, and I don't remember. I I uh, don't. Hang on. No, I don't That's, actively recommend it. I'm gonna it. do it. Uh, okay, it was flies and some bombs. Yeah. Probably not worth it, but hey ho, it doesn't matter. Uh, so should I take the water thing? What do you call it? Holy water! If you were spirit, gonna take that water. If Holy were, water, that's the one. Mm, if you were going to pick that one up, it would might I, have been better to do it? before the bo uh, before re-rolling. I did think that, but I only thought that afterwards, so... Ah. I don't think I'm going to take it. Such a shame, but uh, it doesn't matter. You live and you learn. Hey-ho. Okay. I presume you're on to the, uh, to the next floor? Uh, actually, I re-rolled that, that floor. So I, um, I used my... Forget me now in order to do the same floor again. Ah, okay. Well, not so, exactly the same, but like just a different uh, cellar too. Is it treating you well? Uh, honestly, I don't care how it treats me. The other one gave me, <laughs> <laughs> like, it gave me enough of a good item that I don't really care what happens. Uh huh. Deal with the devil is uh, yeah. kind. See, I. Oh, what did you get? Death Such. And Guppy's Tail. So that's my second Guppy have... item as well. Oh, jeez. That's what, two thirds of the way to becoming Guppy. Not too shabby. Okay. I have made I am, a horrible I am on mistake. one heart. Oh, you and me both. <clears throat> yeah, this is, uh, it's, it's pretty touch and go. Let me tell you that. Yes, yes, it is. Pretty touch and go. Did oh. you did you reroll your uh, your run? Nope. Uh, I've now got Death's Touch Ipecac. <laughs> Good news, everything Ipecac. dies in one hit. Bad news, I fire once per millennia. Jeez. <laughs> is are you gonna be able to come back from this position? I've got Stay nine lives to out. find out. Well, exactly. You know, you've sort of got that uh, nice little bit of assurance there. 
or insurance, should I say. Oh. oh these turrets are wrecking me. Oh, come on, little chub. Do do your work. There we go. You know the you know the turrets that shoot uh, three spread shots. Mhm. Mm so much so much worse than the ones that just fire in a straight line. Yeah. It's because you can't like, like strafe immeasurably them so. Exactly. <laughs> oh, it annoys me to no end. Okay. There okay. is. So are you are you gonna have to fight the haunt again? No, no, no. I got pain instead. Sorry. Oh, okay. There, there is nothing more amusing to me than proptosis on a <laughs> on an ipecac death's touch because the scythe becomes so small at the very end of the travel distance. It's lovely. <laughs> it's damn near the cutest thing I've ever seen in my goddamn life. <laughs> Damn near. Damn near. Okay. I, uh, you know, I, I might have to, uh, to eat my own words. This parasite is actually uh, turning out pretty nice for me. There we go. On a health up pill. The worm has shabby. turned. I know. Okie doke. I'm a way to fight my boss. Fight my boss. Fight the boss. Or in fact, no. No, I no, I will not. I will explore the rest of the floor first because I can. I also got PhD. Have you got PhD yet? No. That makes me sad. My pills. You suck. may on the next floor. Really, I got PhD before I took a single pill, which was nice. It was definitely a good idea. Uh, uh, in fact, I think it was PhD that gave me my first pill, which was quite nice. Um. But I would presume you would you would get PhD later on anyway. Uh, maybe it depends on the source of it. If it's an item room, probably. But I don't it know. Was, yeah. I don't know if that actually, if using the forget me now puts me on basically a completely different seed. Possible. Yeah. It may do. I'm not not entirely sure. Oh, I'm uh, about to be able to tell you. Oh, are you down to the next floor? D20. Nope. Uh, looks like we've got different stuff going on now. Oh, wow. Wow. That's actually really interesting. So, it looks like Forget Me Now can completely alter the the course of a run. Was Pretty your crazy. item room after a room with those four, like, gaping moors in the center? The psychic moors? No. Okay, then yeah, so. my item room is up at the floor. top left. I can't really remember it though. That might just be my memory. This is, what is Catacombs this? A... 1? Yes, it is. And I just got Rosary rosary Beat. Whatever that means. Uh huh. Uh, that's. It increases trinket. your chance to get the Angel Room rather than the Devil Room. Oh, that's quite nice. Is Depends. the angel room uh, on par with the devil room? No. Not even close. No. It's really unfortunate because it would be nice if there were two, like, different options that you could take. Like, oh, I'm going to have an angel room run. I'm going to have a devil room uh -huh. run. But the devil room actually has things that can be used offensively, whereas the angel room has two, count them, two good offensive items. And that is Sacred Heart and Godhead, both of which are special, so it's almost impossible to get either of them. Uh -huh. And it only offers you one item per angel room as well, whereas the devil room offers you many. Yeah. It's not even close, unfortunately. Ah, oh, fudge. That's me dead. Oh, fuck. Well, it's me dead once. Yeah, there you go. That's a good <laughs> reason to have nine lives. Okay. Okay. The dark one. That's the boss. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Which I need to do without getting hit twice. Which is, let's face it, rather unlikely. Oh, you've got it, buddy. I trust you. I believe in you. I, I well, I appreciate appreciate that actually. Okay, that's that's me dead twice again. <laughs> oh, jeez. You got it, buddy. I believe how is, in you. How is <laughs> <laughs> how is how is your run? Tell me about that. Uh, I've got Curse of the Lost, so I'm just fucking wandering around the floor, like trying to guess where my secret room is. Because I have Ipecac, uh -huh. I can open the secret room. I can test everywhere. 
Uh huh. Just takes you a while. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Oh, found what? Oh, blast! I am gonna get this guy. I am gonna get him, without a shadow of a doubt. It's all right, buddy. I trust you. I believe room? in you. <laughs> <laughs> Is there was there anything of interest in your secret room? Yeah, about two cents. About oh, that's not cool. Yeah, it was a golden poop. I got a golden poop. Yeah, golden poop, and then I, because uh, I have a cat, I blew up the dudes behind him, so I ended up getting some extra money. Oh, that's not too shabby. It's not the worst outcome that could have possibly happened, but it's very damn near. Yeah, I suppose counterfeit penny would have been uh, would have been would have been nice. Uh, not for Micro me actually. I've got um, I've got something better than that. What have you got? Mum's pearl, emanating purity. Oh, does that increase your spirit heart drops? It does indeed. Ah. Okay, my question to you is, you see the you see the dark one and he can he can do his uh laser beam attacks. Oh. Mhm. Mm I love it. Uh can he do them up the way? No, he can only do them downwards. Oh, that's good. That that reassures me. Yeah. It's so standing above him is similar to kind of like bloat Standing above bloat. Yeah. Oh goodness. Ah. Oh. It's always two thirds of the two thirds of the way through, and then I just uh, I perish. Oh goodness. I need to work on my game. I uh. I might break the game. How so? I've got D twenty. And I've just found an IV bag, so I'm going to fill an entire room with coins and then re-roll all of them. Okay. Entirely possible. There's still some elements missing, but this could easily become a breaking run, which would suck because I have an Age of Ultron premiere to go to. <laughs> <laughs> Are you are you excited? Are you excited to that? Oh, for the... I'm so fucking hyped. I think it's gonna I be an awesome film, actually. Hyped, man. Just Joss Whedon's involvement makes me super happy. Yeah, he's directing. Uh, yes, he's directing. Oh, there we go. Knowledge. Okay. Oh, come on. Ooh. Oh, that was that was a crying shame. I kicked myself a little bit there. Oh well. You know that warm up I was talking about? Yep. This is this is totally totally honing my skills. This 100% qualifies. Pretty much, yeah, I would say so. Okay. I just need to uh, need to take it take a chill pill and uh, and concentrate. Not like that. Not like that at all. <laughs> Whoa, that's bad. <laughs> so remember when we got three dollar bill? Yes. $3 bill can randomly give you the effect of uh, my reflection, which reflects your tears oh, back at trash. you. So, trash. So, uh, remember when I picked up Ipecac? Yeah. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds uh, a little bit dodgy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's just for the room, though, so. Yeah, it's only for the room, except I keep bombing myself out of rooms when I pick it up. Ah. Oh. That does not sound like fun. Okay. doke. Oh my goodness, the concentration here is not enough. How not many enough lives to you do want it. Uh, I'm on my last life. <laughs> Already. Okay. I'll be honest, that's unfortunate. <laughs> It is a little bit annoying, but that's okay. I will. Sorry, man. I believe I you. Survive. You got this. <laughs> there is, you know, the slight possibility that I actually beat him. There is. But that 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 possibility is becoming lower and lower as the more we progress. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Oh my my keyboard is oh my keyboard died. Oh dear. Oh, Screw that. That that is an unfair ending. That is the worst Jeez. way for that to have ended. The absolute worst. Tire keyboard. Completely gone. So uh I'm just gonna I I got I got ringworm with this setup. 
So now my tears corkscrew through the air. Uh-huh. I don't know they how I feel about that. So if they corkscrew through the air, mm -hmm. and you have my reflection, so they're going to be coming back on you, and they're going to be corkscrewing all the way. Yes. That sounds pretty epic, to be honest. I don't know what you're complaining about. I'm, I'm complaining about the fact that it will prematurely end my existence. Which, by your own admission, would be, uh, would be a, would be a good thing. Yeah. Controversial. I don't know what I'm complaining about. <laughs> so, when you took the opportunity to re-roll your run, did you do so? No. You didn't? Mm -mm. Oh, really? I, I can actually straight up break the video game right now. How? Uh, I've got sharp plug. <clears throat> so I can just take enough... Uh, I can take a spirit heart every single time I re-roll and use it to charge the D uh, D20 to re-roll all items again. To re-roll all of the usables until I get golden chests and then open those into items. Wow. Oh, of course, because you've got uh, Guppy's tail, don't you? Mm-hmm. Jeez Louise. That sounds, uh, that sounds pretty interesting, actually. It's pretty unfortunate. Okay, hang on. <laughs> Let's get this well. shit started. Oh, they're all red chests! <laughs> they're all red chests because I have the left hands. <laughs> what? This I, is I crazy. Just, I just spawned a total of six red chests in the... Oh, and now I'm Guppy. So I guess I dropped the left hand now. That's not... That's not bad. I mean, come on. No, the no, Gopster no. It is 100% uh, not bad. It is good. It is so not bad good. that I think I might describe it as good. Well, in uh, in other news, my keyboard is, uh, is still not working. This is an unfortunate so, turn of events. This is an unfortunate turn of events. So you know what? I'm going to blame this entire run and the fact that it didn't work out on the fact that my keyboard uh, broke down halfway because you know i still maintain that i would probably have defeated uh, the dark one i i'm certain of it exactly i mean i trust you buddy yeah. i believe in you exactly you, you had that. both we yeah exactly 100 totally did totally down with that oh but yeah not not too shabby uh so is there any way to get it working again or <laughs> How is... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This might be. This might just be a, a crazy long episode because not because I wanted to go on forever, but because uh, I just won't be able to stop the recording. <laughs> no idea. Oh dear. No idea whatsoever. Oh well, that's fun. That is fun. So I was uh, I was having a look on your uh, Binding of Isaac achievement list, and you've got all apart from what three achievements or something? Yes. In the Binding of Isaac. What, what are those three? Because I'm sure you probably know. Uh, Platinum God, Real Platinum God. Well, actually, there's some that are hidden on the achievement list, right? So the uh -huh. ones that it says that I don't still have are Blue Candle, Stopwatch, and Platinum God. But then okay. the hidden ones are Real Platinum God, uh, the Mind, the Body, the Soul, D uh, D100, and Godhead. And how do you go about getting all of those achievements? Play the Lost. The Lost. How do you play the Lost? Have you not heard of the character The Lost? No, I know you get one hit and you're dead, unless yeah. you get nine lives, which is a godsend. Mm -hmm. Apparently. That's how you do it. You play that That's... character and win against everything. So how have you um have you got the Lost? Yes, I've unlocked it on my other save file, just not this one. Mm-hmm. How do you how do you go about unlocking it? Uh, you have to die four separate times on four separate runs to very specific enemies using very specific characters. So like you have to use uh, you have to die to a Mullaboom on uh, either basement one or cellar one as I think Isaac to start the run, and then you have to die as oh I want to say. Die as Maggie to one of your own bombs, and then in in a specific floor, and then die as fuck. What's her name? Uh, die as Judas to Mum's foot, 
and then finally Dyer's Azazel to the foot of Satan. Wow. That are those are pretty specific requirements, I must say. Yeah. <laughs> just just a little. So how did how did you do that? You, that must have taken you ages to do. Um not really. Like the only thing that you really need to get is the Mullaboom, and then the rest of it is, you know, just like have a decent run and then throw at a certain point. Yeah. Yeah. That's not uh that's not yeah, it's not not too bad actually. And so that's the real no, that's to unlock the lost. What is the real platinum god? Uh get all of the lost's unlocks. What would what would they be? Uh so the mind, the body, the soul, godhead, D one hundred, and Isaac's heart. All gotten for defeating different bosses. Wow. Yeah. Have you ever completed a run with the lost? I have. On my casual really? play account though. Okay. Yeah. But never on camera. No, dear god, no. The pressure must be intense, like it I I I've refused to unlock it on my actual ca uh sorry, on my um YouTube file because mm -hmm. you know, I'd probably random it once and then just go, "Oh, sorry, I am not skilled enough to do this." So <laughs> Yeah, I think I think that's the thing. I mean, it's never it was never intended to be a serious character, was it? It's just like for the achievement hunters and stuff like that. I mean, yeah, it's it's borderline unplayable. Yes, it is straight I mean, up unplayable. Yeah, I mean, without nine lives, you've effectively got a dead one, character. Yeah, one hit. Yeah, that's um, crazy. That's crazy. What about Holy Mantle? Will that give you two hits? Will Holy Mantle give you two hits? Yes, it will, because uh, it doesn't count yeah. as damage. Yeah. What What else would absorb hits? Both Q of Meat, Rubber Bands, or whatever it is. The um, Any Orbitals will absorb a few hits for you, but obviously that... Um, I mean, what, Infamy is an example of something that... I am actually seriously fucking breaking the... Oh my god. I wish I could share my screen right now without lagging the entire video game, because... <laughs> Like, I've got, uh, <clears throat> so in this room just in particular, I picked up, uh, Fate, uh, Infamy, Max's head, uh, Tammy's head, Guppy's head, uh, Bob's brain, sorry, Bob's head, not Bob's brain, uh, Abel, so far, now I'm just looking for a rune, oh, now there's Bob's brain, now I'm just looking for a rune to re-roll them. So, where are you? Are you on the chest? No. Dear God, no. I'm on Catacombs Jeez. 2. Jeez Louise. That's insane. <laughs> that is absolutely insanity. Oh, and that's a full health right now. Actually, pick that up. I, um... I don't, I, the thing is, I don't know how interesting this is going to be to... Oh, just... Oh my God. Okay, I'm starting to spawn... I am starting to spawn items from the item pool. It is okay. Before this, it was only things from the golden chest pool. Now there are items from the actual item pool. So what does that mean in relation to anything? Uh, if if I if I were so inclined, I could sit here until I had literally every item in the game. Yeah. Okay. Just uh, just an FYI, I have. Uh... I have in all my computery wisdom managed to uh, to fix the keyboard. Oh. I started a new I started a new run as Isaac, and guess what my first item was? <laughs> Three dollar bill. Polyphemus. <laughs> um, I, I know. It's like these runs are always super interesting, and I don't even like doctor anything. It's just random, completely. Okay, so in fairness to you, I will only break until I get Polyphemus to make it equal for both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Let's oh my see. goodness. Polly Femus. Polly. Polly freaking Femus. It's been such a long time. I remember in the original when I got Polly Femus and it, I, I was over the moon. Of course you'd be. Really... It's fucking Polly Femus. I mean, I'm, I'm not entirely sure if it's still as good as it was. Is um, it? Yeah. If I recall correctly, the stats are exactly the same. Oh, well, that's nice. Maybe it just maybe I just haven't got it as much. Oh, oh. my god. First floor, two tinted rocks. Not too shabby. Already some spirit hearts. Not complaining. 
the haunt is the first boss, though, so it sort of makes up for it. Mm. It's to balance mm. you out. It is. It is. It's to, it's to slow me down so I don't go too fast and don't uh, beat the game too quickly, actually. Oh, my goodness. This damage. <clears throat> it's disgusting, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. okay. Just What's this? Seven items sitting in this room that I haven't taken yet. It's eight items sitting in this room that I haven't taken yet. Eight items? Nine. <clears throat> okay, question. There's a key around a chain. What does that mean? Or a chain around... No. Oh, that's, yeah, uh, key that's key latch key. That's lock up plus a spirit heart plus two keys. Okay, that's actually quite good. Yeah, I think so. I could do with that. I could do with that. Yeah, it's not too bad. And um, then there's another item at the shop that you can get. What's it called? Mum's key or something? Mm-hmm. That's no um, idea what it does. Gives you two keys and means that every chest you open from now on is likely to be absolutely fucking pack loaded with items. Oh yeah. Not items, but sorry, um, consumables. Consumables. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I quite like that actually. It's not too bad. Okay, yeah, it's pretty so... good. I'm feeling pretty confident going down to the second floor that I can get a deal with the devil. See, for me, anyway, you know, you can you can consistently get a deal with the devil on the second floor, but I'm not at the stage where I can do that yet, right? So I need to rely on a good first floor that gives me a substantial amount of spirit hearts so that I can actually survive the floor without taking red heart damage. Mm -hmm. You know, because I can't rely on skill alone to get me a deal with the devil. Nor can I. If you know what I mean. I've, I've had I think, it happen so damn often that I just can't get that deal with the devil. I'm like, ugh. And, and if, if you don't get it on the second floor, then that can really sort of mess up the tempo of your run, I feel. Yeah, it puts you so far behind the curve that it's like, oh, well, I might as well just fucking die now. Exactly. Exactly. Oh my god. <laughs> Two tinted rocks on the second floor. Mom's pad, pretty bad, but whatever. That slows enemies, doesn't it? Uh, Mum's pad, I think, actually freezes them. Oh. It, no, it yeah, might make awesome. them run away from you. I keep getting Mum's pad and Mum's bra confused. Oh, no, Mum's bra is definitely the slowing down one. Okay. So that's little Gish that's just spawned in this room, and Mum's contact has just spawned in this room. Mum's contact. Great item. <sighs> yeah. This, um... <laughs> Not good enough for you. Well, no, it's it's not. That's the thing. Because at this point, I could get any item. Your standards have. There's have little changed. brimstone just turns up, just casually fucking chilling in Jeez. my room. There's holy mantle, just whatever. What you're gonna leave holy mantle? <laughs> yeah. Are no, you kidding? I picked it up. Oh, thank God. I would uh, I would question your sanity at that point. I mean, come on, holy mantle. It's, pretty it's good. yeah, it's pretty good. I so sorry, no, go ahead. Wow. I, it's it's so sad to me because I could just straight up break this game like, uh -huh. entirely, but I also have some sort of a time commitment. <laughs> My question is, afterbirth is that going to be? What is that going to be? Are you excited for it? Okay, is it going to be good? So afterbirth is um, teased to be a. Basically a DLC for the game that's going to be basically the size of what Wrath of the Lamb was for the first game. Uh-huh. So that's pretty fucking substantial. Um, I'm, I'm really fucking hyped for it, to be completely honest. It's just the only problem I have with it is, like, I'm probably not going to have all of the other stuff done by that point. Okay. So it'll be, like, a new end game, whereas I still haven't finished this game because I've still got all the lost stuff to do. Uh-huh. That's a that's a legitimate concern, but are the item have, have there been any items teased? Do we have any idea about what could potentially be? There have been a out? lot of items teased. There's really? a trinket that makes it so. There's I think it's called the uh, the bomb diffuser or the wire cutter or something. Um, uh huh. And it's a trinket that makes it so anytime a troll bomb spawns, instead of being a troll bomb, it will um, become a normal bomb just before blowing up. So. My question is that, you know, the more items that, that get stuck into the game, the better. But do you not think that they're going to become more and more situational? Does that not worry you, potentially? No, just because uh, 
I mean, you know, if there's more situations that you can cover, mm -hmm. that's kind of more power, basically. Yeah. Although, I to guess, I, I guess, you know, if you're not choosing what item you get, like if you're not playing in D6 runs, which is like, I guess, my style of run, um, uh -huh. it can become pretty problematic. Yeah. Because you might get some items that are good for a very specific situation, but that situation might never materialize hmm. over the course of an entire run. Yeah. Oh, God. But maybe maybe I'm just uh, just worrying about nothing. I don't know. Probably. I'm a... I think I'm just gonna... I think I'm gonna go all in on the breaking all game. All in? All in. Really? 100% in all of the time. And... How are you going to do that? I mean, I already have 99 of every consumable. Um, <laughs> I, I got the Suicide King card. So I'm... Just, like, feel free to stop me if I sound insane. I'm going to kill myself nine times. <laughs> <laughs> to spend what? my nine lives. Uh-huh. Uh, and in doing... <laughs> <laughs> in do it, I'll, I'll do it in the curse room so that I spawn deal with the devil items. My goodness. Wow, you, you know how to play the game. You might need to watch this run. Okay, so that's Gimpy that's just shown up with my first reroll there. Gimpy's a good item. Gimpy is a good item. I'm not going to dispute that Gimpy is a good item. Um, okay. It's just, it's not, you know, 12 items. So it's not yeah. good enough yet. Okay, so there's yeah, uh, no, Black that. Candle that's showed up. Black Candle? Yeah, Black Candle. Curse up, immunity up. Curse up and evil ups. See, they introduced a whole bunch of new candles, didn't they? I mean, it was just Blue Candle that was in the first one, I think? Mm -hmm. Red Candle and like... Black Candle are the two new ones. Uh -huh. What about Green Candle? There's no Green Candle. In the Afterbirth, maybe? I don't know. If there's one in Afterbirth, I'll be fucking, like, hyped. New Candle. That's the second <laughs> Gimpy. I have two Gimpies on screen right now. Jeez. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna kill my character constantly. Oh, this is so fun. So, so you see the Suicide King um, card. What does it actually do? So it spawns ten consumables on the floor, uh -huh. um, and some of those can be just straight up item pedestals, and the item uh -huh. pedestals generate based on what the uh, item pool you're operating in is. Okay. So I could break in here and get every deal with the devil item. Which is kind of what every I'm doing right deal now. With the, every deal with the devil item. Yeah. Which I think it will do that and then start offering me deal with the angel items as well. So so once you run out of the devil pool, you get into angel I, pool I believe territory. the angel pool for this uh, specific room would happen. Okay, so wow. that, that one... That time just spawned uh, the pentagram, uh, the mark, the pact, and contract from below. Those are all top tier items. Yes, yes they are. Are you gonna Are you gonna take them? No. Who needs them? No. Oh my goodness. I'm already the most powerful man in the world. I don't, I don't, I don't need shit. You disgust me. Absolutely <laughs> disgusting. It's not even... Not even funny anymore. It's just... I'm ashamed. There's there's You've my changed. third guppy's paw. Okay. Third guppy's paw. Yeah, third guppy's paw. Just casual. How, how many times is it, in the, uh, is it in the rotation? Once. How come <laughs> you get it three times then? The game can't keep up with me. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that is 100% the reason, as cocky as it sounds. Seriously? Oh my goodness, that's pretty mental, actually. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm actually, uh, my little run is not going too badly. I'm glad to hear it. I say not too badly. But, you know, it's it's alright. Nothing to complain about. But nothing to, uh, to write home about. Ah, oh, one of those. Yeah, I know. Joke. Right, these guys uh, can go to hell. Screw that. Okay. 
Is there anything else I haven't explored? I should probably go to the rest of the floor, but oh, really, can I be bothered? Not really. Not really at all. No, I don't even want to do that. Okay, screw it, I'll just go fight the boss. Okay, arms pad. There we go. So, who do you reckon, in your opinion, is the uh, is the most difficult boss to fight? Um, just in general, or relative to their position in the game? Well, relative to the position in the game, I presume you'd say the haunt. Yeah. But, in general, the most difficult. That's a hard one, that is. Um... And I can't just include something like a double uh, a double room, like of two of the same boss. No. Damn it. Individually. If that, yeah, if that makes it easier, I don't know. More difficult? No idea. Oh, that's my second Bob's head, by the way. <laughs> oh my goodness. Sorry. Kind of a little bit insane. Yeah. Um. Like, this is actually straight up a breaking run. Like, I usually have to um, um and ah about the definition of a breaking run. This is literally <laughs> a breaking run. I could do this forever and pick every item. Jeez Louise. So, what is there a specific item you're looking for? Yes, Polyphemus, I told you. Oh, did you? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. yes, you said at the start. I'm, I'm going to do it until I get Polyphemus. Um, at which point, you and I will have, you know, the same starting item, so it'll be fair. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, sure, yeah. totally. I'm only interested in making it fair. <laughs> oh, of course. I mean, who am I to question your morals? <laughs> There's the second Abel this run. Abel's a trash item. He's so bad. <laughs> He's absolutely terrible. Like, ashamedly bad. Yeah, I, I had an episode today where I specifically, like, I, I was offered him for free. I was just like, no, 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 no. thank you. I would rather not have it just to make a point about how shit that item is. Yep, not even surprised there. It is a bad item. Oh no, I oh. accidentally killed myself again. Luckily, I've still got two more lives. Oh. Lucky you. Okay. Oh, that's my third Bob's head. Second in the same room. <laughs> <laughs> it's, oh, sitting, it's just fucking sitting next to the other one. It's chilling with my other Bob's head. It's kind of infuriating what you're doing to me. I mean, you're, <laughs> you're teasing with such good items. I would pretty Bob's much head. never have the opportunity to have. Bob's head, Even such Bob's a good head. item. Bob's head is not a bad item. Bob's like, head? Really? No, sorry, not Bob's head. Bob's brain, that's what I That's what I meant. Bob's head oh, is trash. Oh, right. Yeah. Bob's Bob's brain is like, you know, he and I are friends. It, it is a bit, uh, it is a bit challenging occasionally. It does kill you or damage you when you least expect it. Yeah, but I'm working with Ipecac, so... I mean, like, I gotta expect that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go and pick up the heart up here. Uh, that's my second Abel? No, wait, my second Abel in third. this room, my fourth Your third Abel. Abel. Jeez. <laughs> how can you not- how, how have you not got Polyphemus yet? <laughs> this is only giving me shitty items. Oh my goodness. Oh, man. This is beautiful. I love it. That's Lazarus's rags right there. Fucking... I... I don't... I don't... I don't know how to handle it. <laughs> it's too much. Speed down. Oh shit, I actually need more health. Really? Yeah, I need, I need a spirit heart to continue. Are you in danger of dying? Oh no, 100% no. Oh, okay. Good. Just wanted to uh, clarify that. I'll take a speed up, Bill. I need to. I need oh, to be shit. speed down. There's tears up what? in my rotation, and I I've been re-rolling pills the whole time. There's a tears up in my rotation. I could have maximum tear rate. I don't think it makes a damn difference, to be honest, mate. I mean, <laughs> let's uh, let's be frankly honest about this. Okay. I think uh, you're right. You know what? I'll stop when I get a Yarrow rune. How's that? Rather a than what? A Polyphemus. What? A Yarrow rune. Oh, is that a... 
a pink rune thingy? I don't really uh, know what it is. Duplicates all um, items in the room. Sorry, all uh, consumables in the room, including chests. So you take it down to the chest and then you duplicate infinitely. Fair to say it's pretty good then? Yeah. <laughs> Very. Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay, I'm on half a heart, so... Uh, so, you may... Your run may continue past mine. Your legacy will live on. I... God. I hope it doesn't. <laughs> I hope it doesn't. I, I need a Yara rune. I got a Yara rune at the start of this to help me break, but now I wish I just kept that. Yeah. Okay. In all fairness, I am doing a pretty large amount of damage. I don't think it's going to be enough, though. Uh, what about the the Mask of Infamy? The big boss infamy. What's it called? Mask of infamy? Is it called Mask of infamy? Hmm. So I thought that was the the little ones, but I'm not entirely sure. No, it's it's uh it's introduced on screen as the Mask of infamy. Ah, okay. Uh, what do you think about fighting that boss? I think it is. Yeah, it's alright. I don't really mind it. Yeah. Um, it's, it's just like, if you've got a really low shot speed, getting behind it and getting the shots in is really fucking annoying. Yeah. Because oh, it runs on. away at a rate faster than your tears occasionally, and that can be really annoying. Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on, kid. This, this stupid, stupid boss. Which this one? Is ridiculous. The Mask of Infamy. Oh, right, it is that one. Yeah. I am I am having serious problems. Probably because my hand eye hand eye coordination is uh less than perfect. But hey ho, I'll struggle on. Have you got either Polyphemus yet or the other thing that you were after? No, but I've got my reflection, so I've got that going for me. <sighs> oh, I, I, you know, I'm getting to the point where I feel sorry for you. I mean, this is harming me on a spiritual level. You've set yourself unachievable goals. Well, no, I haven't. technically, <clears throat> <achievable. clears throat> tech. Have you got it? No, 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 no. I, I, I just got a different one. Uh, you might know it by the name Perthro. No, uh, by the I way, I also, not. I also have the blank card, so I'm gonna infinitely re-roll my set of twenty items in that other room until I get everything I want. <laughs> Jeez. It's a little bit crazy. It's a little bit crazy. Do you not feel like just finishing the run in like 10 seconds flat or whatever? Oh yeah, as soon as I decide to go, it'll be 10 seconds flat. <laughs> so what what floor are you actually on at the moment? Catacombs 2. Catacombs 2 still? Yes. Oh my goodness. Why, this is where the breaking setup is. I can't leave. I'm on the depths too. What does that mean? Is that... Okay. I gotta count how many items relation? there are in this room. Depths two, that's uh you're two deeper than me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I've got eleven items in this room and the other room has less than eleven. Okay. Perthro re-roll. Okay, uh, and now the game's broken. I've got scapula. I can infinitely re-roll without picking up health ever. So I'm also gonna take SMB Superfan just for funsies. For funsies. Oh my goodness. I'm still a little bit disgusted with, you should uh, be. with what you're doing. You 100% so, should be. I am passing up good items. Like, not even good items. Great items. Absolutely fantastic items you're passing up. Uh, that is chocolate milk. I'll take that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Come on. Like... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I mean, my tier is half the size of the screen. So, yeah, that's good. <laughs> you must have standards, though. I mean, chocolate milk. Come on, really? I, yeah, I picked it up. That's and it's terrible. No. It's so bad. But with chocolate milk with scythes makes tears bigger than the screen. That's what I'm aiming for now. That's that's my end goal. I don't care if I kill <laughs> Blue Baby. My end goal is have tears bigger than the world. Bigger than the world. Bigger than the world, yes. That's quite an ambition. 
It, it's not too far from fruition. <laughs> that sounded perfect. Oh, come on. There we go. Ah, oh, whereas I'm I'm here slogging, slogging through room after room. You'll make it, buddy. One, I one you. health. Unlikely that I'll live. You'll make it, buddy. I believe in you. <laughs> <clears throat> oh goodness me. Well, those angel fetuses were uh, were slightly problematic, but oh, pyro. That's not too bad, but hey, not not really what I need though. Gives me a cool hairdo, but that's about it. <laughs> I think you are severely underestimating the value of having a cool hairdo. <laughs> well, like, you know where you come from, like, people surf and stuff like that. I do. No, like, that, I don't. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, like, I feel that the the hairdo for Pyro is similar to that of a... What is what is the technical term? A surfer dude? Uh... Do you not feel that... Uh... <laughs> my sorry, I hate to interrupt you, but my tear is literally the size of the screen and explodes immediately upon being fired, so it kills me. So are you dead? No. <laughs> I don't think I can die anymore. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Uh like, absurdity. Very little idea what's going on. Oh goodness me. Oh, sure. I'll fucking take Capricorn and Cricket's body. <laughs> take sp I'll take sad bombs. I don't give a shit. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just passing up technology. Technology is a good item. It's a great item. I don't want it. <laughs> oh, this is the most fun I've ever had. <laughs> Well, I'm glad it could be on a on a run where the seed was chosen by me. I I, I think it is entirely because you chose the seed. I t I have no idea. Like all the seeds we've done have been super super interesting. Mm. Like really very interesting. Oh, screw it. That's me dead. That is me dead. I. That is a crying shame. I don't know what I should like. Do you want me to just like finish my run? Because it will take <laughs> me two seconds. I have no idea. It is completely up to you. It is completely up to you. I'm I'm going to stand by my word. I'm a man of my word. I said uh -huh. that I was going to get polyphemus and then stop. And so I can get I can just I can just reroll these yes. until I get polyphemus. Do it. Make it happen. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can't believe it. What's the uh, what's the closest that you've got to Polyphemus? And I mean that in what's the a comparable damage item? I mean, is there better damage items than Polyphemus? Yeah, there are. Um, uh, uh, oh fuck! Off the top of my head, I can't think of one. The mark is that better? No, not even close. It's not a damage multiplier, and that's the point. Um, that's the reason that the mark isn't better. Okay. Whereas Polyphemus's strength comes in from the fact that it has like a 2.3 times multiplier. So it scales with whatever you get. Scales with whatever you get, plus it gives you like an incredible amount of damage as well. Wow. That's not too bad. I mean, there was always a... Uh, oh! Was... What? Tough Love, Sagittarius for penetrative shots, and Tiny Planet. <laughs> Isn't this the second time that you've had the option of picking Tiny Planet in a run with me? I think the it whole, is. Did the you whole, not take... The whole screen is covered by my tear after I shoot it for a total of 12 seconds. It, it stays in the air for 12 seconds. I don't even know what to say. I don't even think there is anything that... Eve's Mascara, two times tear... Uh, Two times damage multiplier. I don't think there is anything to say at this point. I think... Um... Did it, is the damage not capped? No. No, no, no. There is no cap for damage. There is a soft cap, but you can fucking fully exceed that if you have multipliers. There used to be a cap, didn't there? In the mm -hmm. last game. It, it was still a soft cap, though. Okay. So you could break it with enough multipliers, but... 
Wow. Wow. I am going to watch this run for sure. I think you have to. I think I, I definitely will. I definitely will. 100%. Uh, so are you still on Catacombs 2? Yes. Jeez Louise. Feel free to tell me at any point that I should just go win the game. No, I'm just going to take these items and go. Fine. No Polyphemus. No, Instead, no. I got Parasite, Split Shot. Uh... Oh, God. I can't see the screen. <clears throat> I cannot so see the you, screen. So are you going to beat uh, the bosses in one hit? Is that what you're expecting to do? If I have to fire a shot, I will be surprised. I think one fly from me will kill oh, a of boss. Course. Of course, because you're guppy as well. Yeah. So now here's the deal, right? If you uh, get the option to reroll your run, you've got to take it. No, I can't, actually. I've taken so many items this far that if I re-roll the run, I will lose every item that I have. Really? Yes, it will re-roll. It will try and find items. There won't be any more items for it to give past like a few more. Uh, and it will give me breakfast constantly. And that is breaking the game, getting breakfast. <laughs> wow, you should totally do it. Are you fucking mental? <laughs> this is the most fun I've ever had. What are you doing? Why do you hate me? <laughs> uh, no, that's that's good. I'm, I'm happy your run has gone so well. One day, one day I will rival. <laughs> I will, I will rival you. I just walked into the item floor on the next floor and it's Polyphemus. <laughs> Really? Yes. That's fantastic. Uh, now your your mission can be complete. So that's why. So the it, So if it's already in the item room pool, then it can't be. So they must have that already planned out. Does that make sense? If it's already in the item room pool. Oh no no well, no. Because um, you. I, no I. It, uh, I've just seen so many other items that I've forced it to appear. Ah. Because okay. nothing else okay, could. That makes sense. That's what well, I so actually means... expected would have happened ages ago. Oh, there's another damage up, Blood of the Mana. That's what I expected would have happened a long time ago, but it actually took surprisingly long time for it to actually start. So if you'd re-rolled that room on the Catacombs 2 one more time, then you would have got Polyphemus. Most likely, yes. Almost definitely, yes, I feel. Like, that was next in the queue. Perhaps uh, that I don't I'm, know. I'm not certain if there is really a know. queue. I don't know how if, if that's how that works. Uh huh. I don't, see, I, I don't know either. Oh wow. No oh, shit. I scared myself with my own tears. Oh, <laughs> uh, the adversary died too. Immediately. Oh um, my goodness, that's that's crazy. That is crazy. I'm... I'm slightly concerned. <laughs> this may be... You're concer I'm, I'm not concerned. surprised. I'm not surprised, like... Oh, God damn it. It's too much! It's too much damage! I could kill myself at any point. I don't have, like... Like, I have all of the damage items in the video game. I have almost none that actually, uh, replenish my health. So how much health do you have? Uh, currently three and a half red hearts. Seriously? Yes. Are you telling me you're gonna die? I'm telling you there is a distinct possibility. Really? Wow, I think if you did, that would be the first run you've lost in this series. It would be. It definitely would so be. So don't, don't let just, it happen. I just found the Emperor card, so I'm actually just gonna speed run the rest of the game. So I just killed mum. I I would like you to help me count exactly how long it takes me to go through to kill all of the rest of the bosses in the video game. My timer just started, so uh, we're on five seconds now. Okay, that's that's excellent. Okay. Okay, challenge is on. Mission my, accepted. My tier is so big that it actually can't hit anything because it hits the walls first. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I mean, I'm trying to imagine what it would look like, but I just, I just can't. Like, what color is it? Red. Red is and it? green. 
Green red because of Ibikak and, and red because oh. of um, ke uh, Chemical Peel. Oh, of course, you've got Ipecac. Yeah, I forgot. I did forget about that, actually. Okay, and this is the next boss. Mama Gertie. Oh, she died to a fly. One fly. Yeah, she died to a fly. Oh, my goodness. That's crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Uh, we're on... We're just hitting a minute right now. Oh, dear. I better pick up the pace. I know. You're, you're slacking, mate. You're slacking. I really am. Uh, so who's next? Is that... It Lives? Uh, yes, it'll be It Lives. Okay. Dude. God in heaven. So, do you still have blank card? Yes. I'm blank carding so just... a Emperor card so that I can move ah. through the fours yeah. as quickly as possible. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. So what was the original combination of items that allowed you to break the game? Technically, or uh, reroll. <clears throat> sharp plug and D20. That's just what all I started with. So the sharp plug means that if there is no charge on your current spacebar item, and you try and use it, it will instead use two hearts. Uh, it will take two hearts of damage uh, from you, and it will recharge your item. Wow, that's pretty good. Yes, yeah, it's, it's relatively good. It's quite costly. Oh, and Excuse. that's that's Isaac dead. I Isaac. Isaac dead. Oh god, just past the two minute mark. Two minutes fifteen right now. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna actually have to take twenty twenty double shot to double the amount of tears that I fire at all times. <laughs> oh, and that's blue baby dead. So really? yeah. That that, so that was a. So that's the end of the video game. That's two minutes twenty eight <laughs> seconds. <laughs> That's quite impressive. Those last bosses were done in about 20 seconds combined. Yeah, I couldn't charge my item because they died. I couldn't charge my uh, shot because they died to the flies first. Jeez Louise. That's yeah. a little bit crazy. Oh my God. God, I wish I had the time because I would, I could have, I could have done, I could have fished the game to get Sacred Heart. Uh, just every, I, I'm, I'm a little too hyper right now. Do you want to take it out? <laughs> yeah, no problem. Um, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching The Binding of Isaac Rebirth X2. Um, yeah, we'll hope, we hope you will uh, join us next time for some more Binding of Isaac action, because uh, we certainly have good fun doing it. And, uh, and yeah, we'll see you next time. Adios. Bye.